Turkmenalem 52 degrees east, Monokosat formerly referred to as Turkmensat 1 is Turkmenistan's first satellite, built by Thales Alenia Space in the Can Mondalu Space Center. Launched from Cape Canaveral on 27 April 2015 aboard a Falcon 9 V1.1 rocket, the satellite operates at 52 degrees east in the geostationary orbit and has an anticipated service life of 15 years. The 52 degrees east position is controlled by the Principality of Monaco and the satellite includes 12 transponders that are referred to and commercialized as Monacosat as well as the 26 transponders referred to as Turkmenalem. The satellite is operated by the Turkmenistan National Space Agency. Wide Network Solutions is the satellite's biggest commercial operator. History In 2009, Space Systems International, Monaco, SSI Monaco signed a license agreement with the Monaco government for the development and use of the 52 degrees east orbital position for the Monacosat project. In November 2011, the Turkmenistan Ministry of Communications signed agreements with Thales Alenia Space to build the first Turkmenspace satellite of the Turkmenistan NSSC National System of Satellite Communications program, and with SSI Monaco to use the 52 degrees east position, including the right for SSI Monaco to use 12 Ku-band transponders on the satellite as Monacosat. In July 2013, global satellite operator CES and SSI Monaco signed an agreement for CES to commercialize the 12 Monacosat transponders and integrate Monacosat into the CES fleet. The satellite was originally intended to be launched on a Chinese Long March 3B rocket, but international traffic in arms regulations prevented some U.S. made parts being exported to China for the launch, and so in June 2013 it was switched to a SpaceX Falcon 9 V1.1 launcher, and planned for late 2014, early 2015. The launch was initially scheduled for the 21st of March 2015, but this was delayed to study a problem with a helium pressurization system on the Falcon 9 rocket, and a new launch date was set for no earlier than the 24th of April 2015. SpaceX clarified the reason for the delay. The issue wasn't with the helium bottles themselves, but rather other bottles from a similar lot that failed testing at the company's assembly plant. We identified a potential condition that could be shared with those on board the Thales vehicle. The subsequent launch on the 27th of April 2015 successful positioned the satellite at 52 degrees east. Topic: <coughs> Coverage. <coughs> 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 The Turkmenalem 52 degrees east, Monacosat satellite has 38 Ku band transponders providing coverage in Europe, the Middle East, Africa, and Asia with three downlink beams. The west beam is centered on Turkmenistan, Kazakhstan, and Uzbekistan with 53 dBW power providing reception on dishes down to about 50 cm. The beam extends at lower powers northeast across Russia, north across Scandinavia to Svalbard and west across Europe to the Atlantic with a second high power lobe over France and southern UK. The east beam is also centered on Turkmenistan, Kazakhstan and Uzbekistan with a slightly reduced power 52 dBW and extends west across central and northern Europe with a second 52 dBW lobe over northwest France. The MENA beam is centered on the Arabian Peninsula and North Africa Libya with a maximum power of 51 dBW, and extends as far south as Sudan and Ethiopia. <laughs> Monacosat The Monacosat payload of 12 Ku band transponders commercialized by CES provides capacity for DTH broadcasting over the Middle East and North Africa, in addition to resources for trunking and data services in Europe, the Middle East, North Africa, and Central Asia. In particular, Monacosat provides growth potential for the Abu Dhabi based Yasat and CES joint venture bouquet Yaliv, additional to the broadcasts from Yasat 1A at the adjacent orbital position of 52.5 degrees east. See also Telecommunications in Turkmenistan Telecommunications in Monaco CES SpaceX List of Falcon 9 launches <laughs>